Chuckers, what are we gonna draw today? A hippo. Yeah, we're gonna draw a silly hippo. <laughs> All right, Jude, you got your marker? Yep. All right, okay, we're gonna start with our paper, horizontal, paper. or also, what else is this called? Landscape. Landscape, yeah, kind of if we were to draw a landscape, which is like a scenery with a sunset or something. The reason why it's called that is because it's kind of a nice way to do a landscape, huh? Because mm -hmm. you can get a lot in the picture. And if you were to turn the, the, the paper this way, what, what's another word for this? Uh, Vertical. We have, we've never talked about it, but also this could be called portrait which is like a picture yeah. of a person. So you can imagine a person, you could easily get them in here because it, if you were standing up, you could fit them all in there, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we're gonna start with our paper. Landscape. Yes, landscape. And we're gonna draw a really silly hippo. He's gonna be awesome, kind of a cartoon. Ready? Mm -hmm. All right, so we're gonna first start with a C, kind of diagonally over here. And this is gonna be for his first eyeball. Good job. It's popping out. It's popping out. Yes, hippos kind of have eyeballs that are popping out. <laughs> so now right next to the C, we're going to draw another, his other eyeball, but we're going to draw a circle. And then we're going to draw a C inside the circle like that. Good. And then we're going to draw a circle inside of that for his pupil. And then a little one inside of that. For the circles. light catcher, a lot of circles. And, and then we're gonna color it in. We're halfway done. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna draw the, the rest of his eye over here, but it's gonna turn into his nose. So we're gonna draw, here we go. We're gonna draw this that comes over and then down. So the hippos kind of have. <coughs> oh, bless you. Why do you always <laughs> sneeze in our videos? I don't know. I'm like. <laughs> Are you allergic to art? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so <laughs> go ahead and draw that. It's kind of like a, a hook or candy cane line. Yes, and then we're gonna draw the circle. Well, it's kind of a half circle inside and this is for his pupil. It's over on that side of his eye or that eye. And we're gonna draw a little one for the light catcher and then color it in. Yes, we got both eyes done <laughs> and part of his nose. All right, so now we're going to draw his big kind of mouth. So we're going to draw a big C that comes around and stops. Good, good. Okay, and then we're going to draw another one over here. It's kind of a J and it's going to stop. How is that a J? Well... I don't know, not really. It's kind of a C, backward C. <laughs> okay, then we're gonna draw his cheek line right here. Good, and then let's draw his nostrils. We're gonna draw a little curly line, and then another curly line over here. We could draw it the other direction. I think when I was younger, I tried to make mazes, but the, these were how I made the mazes. <laughs> and I was like... Yeah, it kind of does look like a maze, huh? You could make a whole big, huge maze out of those. Okay, and then we're gonna draw a uh, curved line on top and a curved line on top over here. Good job. Okay, now let's draw. They get little hairy beards on their <laughs> face. We're gonna draw little lines going across this. Looks like there's this a big giant mouth. Looks like stitches. Yeah, it kind of does. And then I'm gonna draw a little ones up on top too. Good job, you did it. Okay, all right. Now we're gonna draw. Yeah, now we're gonna draw the top of his body. And we're gonna start from this eye, and we're gonna come over, and then we're gonna stop. Let's see. Keep going just a little bit further, just bit over, first. just past the eye. Yeah. Okay. And then we're gonna draw his ear over here. So a little leaf shape. Good. And then we're gonna. I'm gonna draw another line right there. Now we're gonna draw his other ear and we're gonna draw the, another leaf shape right here. Good, and then this line, I'm gonna continue like that. Good, okay, now let's finish his body. So we're gonna imagine this line going through his ear and then coming out the other side and it's gonna curve all the way down into 
Oops. Into his foot. Could be a girl, too, I guess. Could be drawing a girl hippo. All right. Oh, you can draw a bow. <laughs> yeah, I can draw a little bow for, or eyelashes. <laughs> All right, okay. Now we're going to draw his uh, the bottom of his foot. So we're going to draw a little line that comes here. Across the bottom. And then we're going to draw a little line that comes up. Good. Hey, now let's draw his uh, the bottom of his neck. And we're going to draw a couple curved lines that come down and out. So I draw three kind of fanned out. Good job. Okay, now we're going to draw his front leg. So it's going to come down. Good. And then a line that comes across for the bottom of his foot. And then up. Good job. Okay, now I'm going to come down here. We're going to draw his belly. So it's going to come across the bottom. And then we're going to, oop, get a little jumpy there. And we're going to curl up. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, now let's draw his other leg so he looks 3D. And we're going to draw another line that comes out. And then back. Good job, dude. Okay, and then we'll draw the other one that's in the back leg over here. It's kind of a backwards L. Good. All right, let's do his toenails. So we're going to do three bumps. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, kind of a third one in there. One, two, three. And we got his toes in there. All right, we're missing a tail. Should we do a tail? Yeah. <laughs> what do hippos have? Huge tails or small tails? Huge. No, they're little. <laughs> We're going to just draw a little tail up top there. Good job. All right. <laughs> we did our hippo. You know what else we could do? That would be kind of fun. We could do, um, let's draw, let's make him underwater. Okay. So we're going to do some waves across right under his eyes. Because they were on his eyes, and then you could draw like his eyes watering. Yeah. Like, oh, my eyes. <laughs> and then we can, should we do the grass? Well, let's do underwater grass. <laughs> so just do a little zigzag line. And a fishy. <laughs> should we put a fish underwater yeah. for his friend? Mm -hmm. All right, we could do a little fish. That would be fun. And we do a leaf shape. This is kind of an easy way to do a fish. Do a leaf shape. And then do a W for the tail. And you can do a little leaf shape for the fins. And do a little eye. Oh. And then a mouth. Or I could just do <laughs> a like he's gonna weird eat fish. You're gonna do a weird fish? No, just do oh, yeah. I like those. It's those are awesome. On a a circle on a triangle. That's an easy way to do a fish. That's really cool. Did you have fun? Look at that hippo, yeah. man. That's a silly hippo. Is that fun? Uh -huh. We drew him kind of cartoonish. Uh -huh. <laughs> we hope you guys had fun drawing your cartoon hippos with us. Be sure to take a picture. Oh, and color it. They should color it too, huh? Be sure to color it and then take a photo and post it on our art club, huh? Yeah. Where's that at? artforkidshub.club Yes, artforkidshub.club We want to see how your hippos turned out. And we'll see you later, our friends. Bye. Goodbye. I'm a hippo. Oh, I'm a hippo. <laughs>